great things are done by a series of small things brought together. I put my heart and my soul into my work, and have lost my mind in the process. I often think that the night is more alive and more richly colored than the day. I feel that there is nothing more truly artistic than to let people. What would life be if we had no courage to attempt anything? I dream of painting and then I paint my dream. For my part I know nothing with any certainty, but the sight of the stars makes me dream. If you hear a voice within you say you cannot paint, then by all means paint, and that voice will be silenced. I am still far from being what I want to be, but with God's help I shall succeed. The fishermen know that the sea is dangerous and the storm terrible, but they have never found these dangers sufficient reason for remaining ashore. The way to know life is to learn many things. There is no blue without yellow and without orange. There may be a great fire in our hearts, yet no one ever comes to warm himself at it, and the passers-by see only a wisp of smoke. As we advance in life it becomes more and more difficult, but in finding the difficulties the inmost strength of the heart is developed. Love many things, for therein lies the true strength, and whosoever loves much performs much, and can accomplish much, and what is done when love is done well. The more I think about it, the more I realize there is nothing more artistic than to love others. One must work and dare if one really wants to live. Even the knowledge of my own fallibility cannot keep me from making mistakes. Only when I fall do I get up again. Paintings have a life of their own that arrives from the painter's soul. In spite of everything I shall rise again. I will take up my pencil, which I have forsaken in my great discouragement, and I will go on with my drawing. A good picture is equivalent to a good deed. Poetry surrounds us everywhere, but putting it on paper is, alas, not so easy as looking at it. It is not the language of painters but the language of nature which one should listen to, the feeling for the things themselves. For reality is more important than the feeling for pictures. Do not quench your inspiration and your imagination. Do not become the slave of your model. One may have a blazing heart in one's soul and yet no one ever came to sit by it. Passers-by see only a wisp of smoke from the chimney and continue on their way. How can I be useful? Of what service can I be? There is something inside me. What can it be? The best way to know God is to learn many things. When I have a terrible need of 
shall I say the word religion? Then I go out and paint the stars.